Rock the Block is basically a way to reach out to the neighborhood, to the kids. It was a wonderful community event, and being a teacher in Prince William County, um, I just saw what a wonderful way it was to have um, staff, students, and uh, members of our church community come together and provide uh, needs for these students, uh, be it clothes, uh, backpacks. Different items so that kids can be prepared to go to school. Um, we also have a lot of fun and entertainment to um, build the community, so we're going to have um, food and art, um, and this year we're going to have a BMX show, so it's going to be um, serving and also fun. I've found over the years that when I get involved in any of the church activities, it brings me closer to God and I really feel good about being helpful to other people. There's just something to do for all ages of people, kids, uh, teens, um, and it's just, it's a, it's a great way to give back to the community and to kind of root yourself um, where, we, where we go and where we, you know, attend church every Sunday. I think it's a good way um, to get to know other members of the congregation when you work together uh, on a project, helping other people, uh, you fellowship with other people in the community or in the fellowship in the congregation that you may not normally do during church. So I think it's just a good way um, to help out other people and to help out um, just to getting to know other people uh, in, in the congregation. There was one family there that, I think there were three kids in the family, and they had never gotten anything that was brand new for, for school, as far as books, uh, clothing, supplies like that. And the look on these kids' face was just amazing. Just watching the faces of the kids as they were going through the backpacks trying to figure out which one they want, their facial expressions were just good. I ran into a student um, I had a wonderful experience with that attended Woodbridge High School, and um, her sister is a student at King Elementary, and her dad um, has been battling terminal cancer for the last, um, I would say nine, ten months, and so it just, um, it was not happenstance to see Bao and her little sister at this event um, coming in to get the things that they needed. At um, the block party last year, um, I talked to a kid who has now been going to our youth group for like a year, um, so there's definitely, you know, outreach that has continued on. Um, and you know, people have joined our church because of it, so a lot of good happening. Rock the block, August 8th. Rock the block, August 8th. Rock the block, August 8th. Rock the block. Where's the block part? <laughs> August 8th. What? Rock the block, August 8th. August 8th. Yeah. Rock the block, August 8th.